like so goofy. I'm such a big kid, I'm not gonna lie. So today, we're gonna be talking about the power of being present and how, just how beautiful it really is. I think that the concept of time is kind of wild because it is created by us. It gives us cues to do specific things a certain way and you know it just allows us to stay within this frame of our brain um, when it comes to all things of life and time is crazy but time is a gift and that really is the essence of it time is a gift life is a gift so we have to figure out how to stay appreciative of this beautiful gift that we have of living and make the best of it. I'm in a transitional season in my life and I realized how how much I was just thinking about the future. Like I constantly was thinking about the future and how that takes away from me being present and, and appreciating literally where I am in life. And I think if we realize how much this takes away from us like we wouldn't we wouldn't do it so much naturally we're going to set goals naturally we're going to set expectations of life and what we want to come out of life goals are very important but i think that the more we kind of release that idea of having to do specific things at a specific time the more we can really live and just let things kind of flow and create its own time that that is when we can really let things happen organically i think being present allows a getting out of your head especially if you're a controlling person if you want things to happen a specific way this challenges you so much because when you're living in the present you're not worried about what's gonna happen you're just fully trusting that everything will work out and I think that is the best way to live for a while y'all I, I really was out here leaning on my own understanding trying to calculate and control every almost every aspect of my life and I just I just realized how draining it was I think we have to let go of an expectation of things happening in a specific time in a specific order. I think freedom comes in that. And I'm saying this because I used to be a control freak. It's okay to acknowledge that we don't get to control every aspect of our life. The things that we can control, great. I'm very grateful. You know, we're grateful that we can. The things that we can't we let that be we let that be it is a true testing of do you believe everything's going to work out do you fully trust in god know that the pressure that you put on yourself when it comes to time and the future it only takes away from your life we all should just embrace where we are be content y'all it allows you to live differently when you're not so worried about time you live more freely. You actually live. Oh, if you're the type of person, oh, I need to be back home at this time so I can get enough rest or I can get enough. You don't live. I don't think we should live a life based on how much time we have. It, everything goes back to the gift of life in general. We're not here forever. And the more we tap into the, being present and content, the more f fulfilling our life will be. I didn't even know I was going to get into the concept of time and all the things, but because I've always been somebody that's worried about how much time I was spending, I didn't realize how much a gift it was until life happened. And I'm like, oh, wow, you know, I'm just blessed to be here. I'm blessed with everything I have in this moment. I'm not worried about how much time or how much sleep I'm going to lose by staying out late tonight. Because first of all, I don't even know if I'm going to be, I don't even know if I'm going to wake up tomorrow. I think we should surrender to how our lives unfold and not try to control our future. I think we should just trust that what is in our heart and our desires will be fulfilled.
It is not about time and when it's going to happen. It's about being patient enough to let it unfold. There is power in releasing control. There is true power in releasing the concept of time and just living. I hope that this helps you guys to really appreciate where you are in life and know that everything happens for a reason. Thank you.